Hey guys, it's Waldo here, and uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to make the classic Knife Party Whoop Synth, as made famous by the song Internet Friends. Uh, if you don't know what the song is, or you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll play a little clip for you. Okay, and this is my recreation. Alright, let's get started. I want to open up Massive, and this is one of my save presets, and um, if you want to just pause it right now, copy these settings, feel free to do so, but if you're cool and you want to watch the whole video, well, let's get started. Okay, your first oscillator, you're going to want to choose the hard sync option, and take the wavetable position all the way down, and prick the intensity all the way up, and the amp all the way up. Then you want to take the pitch and put it up two octaves. And that's about it for all of the oscillators. So, moving on to the filter. You want to choose the scream filter option. Put the cutoff just a little past three. Uh, scream at about 10.30ish. Uh, and resonance about 9.30ish. Turn this all the way up. And put the mix all the way up to filter one. Moving on to the effects. Um... These effects are optional or changeable. Um, I like these effects because it makes it sound more a little more polished, a little more well-rounded. Um, but for FX1, I did a dimension expander. I put the dry wet just a little bit below nine, and the size at about nine thirty ten ish. Um, FX2, I did a chorus. Um, dry wet, I put it about ten ish again. Uh, rate just a little bit above nine and I left the offset and depth as they were and also no EQ moving on to um, this here section very important for the uh, oscillators tab the pitch bend option you want to put the pitch bend up an octave and down an octave moving on to the envelopes this is the only envelope you're going to be using um, what you want to do is take the attack down to about 830-ish and put the level all the way up. Decay at about 930-ish and the level all the way down. And then you want to drag this uh, first envelope over to the first oscillator and take it down an octave. Uh, okay, moving on to the inserts. Um, again, these are optional. Well-rounded, well-polished. You got the, you get the gist of it. Um, hard clipper at about, you know, uh, 10.30-ish, 11, and the drive, same position. Bit crush, dry water all the way up, and crush all the way up. And that about does it for the massive patch. Um, moving on to here. This is the MIDI clip. Um, the notes are F2, and then the F1 for the last note. And if you're using Ableton and you don't and you don't know how to get the pitch bend effects, um, what you want to do is go to your MIDI clip, uh, click this envelopes button over here, and choose the pitch bend option. And then for your first um, note on beat four in the first measure, you're going to, want to take that down all the way, the octave. And then beat four the second measure, you're going to, want to take that up all the way up the octave. And um, I used this recently in one of my own songs. It's called My Creation. Go check it out. But if you want to use this in one of your own songs too and you uh, like the offbeat feel of this, I found the best note length for it was 1 16th note. If you do 8th notes, it becomes a little long and drawn out. Uh, it just sounds wrong. But if you do the 16th notes, you get that pop. Uh, yeah, that about does it. Um, go check me out on SoundCloud and YouTube, and uh, yeah, have a nice day.